Hi and welcome, it's Rebecca, also known as 4 Kids at 147, and I'm bringing you my week 16 of Project Life today. And for this, I'm using the Citrus Twist April kit again, and these absolutely gorgeous puffy stickers. So I've cut up some of the papers that come in the kit, and I've sort of, I pick those depending on the photos that I've got. So that's how I tend to start with the kit. I'll pick a kit that's got the sort of look of the photos. And then I will mess about with the papers and the cards that do come in it just to see what looks nice um, with the photos sat on them, what makes the photos pop. And then from there, um, I'll then pick all the cards to bring in the rest of the colours around the spread. So I knew for this one I wanted to use those little puffy stickers. So I wanted the words to go in a few different places on the page. So I've got work, school and play, which also sort of have a little mini theme about them. Um, and I'm going to bring in a few different labels to help make those words pop as well. So I'm just cutting apart a label from the cut apart sheet to start off with and I've got all those words in place now I've also put the word work on a label so I'm going to add some tags uh, some twine to the little tags that I've got and for that I just use um, some crochet thread stuff that I picked up from Hobbycraft I've got a huge ball of that so it's going to last me for quite a while and I'm actually going to use these little um, tags to be my little journaling spots rather than having a journaling card as such for this week. I'm going to pull in some of those little tiny word stickers as well. So at the bottom where it says school, I've got today is the day. And then up at the top, I'm just going to tuck in that um, tag, get my twine to sort of sit where I want it to and add on the word play and then on the the whiteboard picture which is um i spent a whole weekend with my silhouette cutting this out for work i've just tucked behind it a die cut that just brings in that peach color in another place um, it's just sort of a little layer i don't do that too often on project life but i do um, i should do it more really i do like sort of matting my photos a bit like i do with scrapbook layouts really so I'm going to start to add in some of my journaling. So on this bottom card, I've just put that um, my eldest Megan went to the inclusive classroom event uh, at the Birchwood Chester University campus this Saturday. So quite simple, really, um, as to where she was, which was good because she came home for it. Um, and then at the on the top card it just says while she was home Megan went out with Amy to see Greece it was lovely to have her home even if it was only for a short time and then because my journaling wasn't too long on this card um, I did look for something to add to it and I just added this leatherette sticker that says around here I was looking at popping something else on it but then I just decided to extend my journaling so I do end up with two paragraphs of journaling by the time I'm done and I've just added in a little word sticker that says so much to see and that's sort of a snapchat um, image that she's given me there which quite often is what I do get off my kids um, and then the couple of other photos because I've not sort of done a collective journaling card I did feel as though they needed a little something to say what they were because I might remember now but I'm definitely not going to remember in a few years so this is just a picture of my son and um, as my daughter came home on the bus she found her brother so I'm just going to pop on there um, that she found him on the bus on the way home and it's just got a little high five sticker with that one and then I will have another look for some more labels and this will just be for on the bottom picture I don't know if anybody else in the UK has seen the sort of dandelion outbreak we've had this year um, I'm not sure if it's because the spring slash summer has been more winter than summer uh, but when we did decide to have a hot weekend it just seemed as though the garden exploded um, it has had quite a bit of a trim but it does still need some work to be ready uh, in case we do get a full summer I'm gonna add in oh some of these gorgeous hearts I 
absolutely love these hearts. Uh, they're little leatherette stickers. I'm not sure if they're my new love over puffy stickers. They, they, it's definitely um, hard between the two. It really is. Um, I'm just going to add some journaling to this other card and it's just spent, I spent the weekend making a new board for work. Um, so I just picked a font and did sort of a departure board type style for work and as I say I spent most of the weekend cutting and sticking but I do love doing things like that so it's not so bad. So all I'm really doing now is the last sort of finishing touches I want to make sure that I bring each of the colours um, over into most of the cards so I do want to have an element of pink on most of the cards which a lot of it has been brought in with the words. I've brought in a couple of the star die cuts that you get to bring in some blue on this work card because there was no blue over sort of that corner of the page and then a lot of it is just say all the the little bits and pieces. I have brought in my um, craft stash challenge items in a bid to get something from my craft stash challenge on my layout and you can see videos on that in my craft stash challenge playlist where I'm just trying to get little bits used up that sort of get forgotten about or there's not many things left on the sheet and for this layout I think I pretty much used most of these peachy colour things on the Bella drops so I'm going to pop some of the little triangles to sort of point in and echo that arrow theme and then I'm just going to bring the last one over onto the left uh, just because it wasn't going to stay on that sheet otherwise it would never have got used not when there's only one there. I've got an element of dots and stuff as well on the bottom and then I just wanted to add something to this uh, card sky uh, blue skies up ahead I uh, brought that in to bring in the big pop of blue but I felt as though it just needed something else to help tie it in with the rest of the page. So I've brought in a peachy coloured heart and one of the little pink stickers that just says love the gushy stuff. And then my last bit really is just to add, add a little spot of journal into the last photo. All the other photos have got a label or something on. So I did feel as though, even though this was just the kids uh, watching friends in the house, I did feel as though it needed something putting on there just to echo the rest of the spread. And that is my week 16 pretty much done. Uh, I'm just going to add a, a little well half a heart uh, on this bottom corner just to fill that little white space gap and also bring some of that peachy yellow. I'm going to hold it up so you can see um, closely the cards and then I will show you some close-up pictures as well but if you've liked what you've seen please hit like and if you want to see more please hit subscribe. Speak to you all again soon.